which we've ran into a bunch of. Again, that's why we're going with Flip TV. So YouTube, I hate to tell you this, you're losing views. You could be making money off us. Instead, we're having to go to Blip. Not that I mind that, but I mean, you're still gonna. We're still gonna put the previews up on YouTube. YouTube still gets a lot of a wider, a lot more traffic than Blip does. So we're still gonna put the previews up on YouTube. My videos, my little blogs, diaries are gonna be up on YouTube. So um, if you want to check out our actual production company stuff, though, you're gonna have to go to Blip. Sorry, that's just how it is. Um. But yeah, it's 11.30. I'm probably going to watch the new uh, Bleach at 1. I think it's 1. It's either 1 or 12. Not sure. Uh, I believe it's 1. New episodes start tonight. Woo! Um, it is a filler arc, though, so I'm not holding any big hope for anything that it's going to be about. Plus, I love anime. I really love anime. Um, not a big fan of Bleach, though. Liked it when it first started, but when you're basically watching for three weeks for what amounts to one episode because of just the amount of filler in episodes, it gets really annoying really fast. It's like the old Dragon Ball Z. Um, <laughs> you you watch the week's worth of episodes and they actually amount to about a day's worth of episodes with all the stopping, posing, buffing up. Um, so that's pretty much going to be. That's what I think of Bleach. It's too long, too drawn out. Story, it's okay. I don't read the manga. I probably should. Uh, I hear the manga's pretty good uh, right now. I check on the manga every once in a while. Same thing with Naruto. Uh, I check on the manga, see where it's at, and what the story's up to right then, basically, on Wikipedia or wherever. Um, Bleach just like Naruto. Or, or Naruto just like Bleach. It's just too hard to watch. It's painful. You, you start to get into an episode and it ends. It's painful to watch. I'll be gr I'll be glad when the re-edits come out, just like Dragon Ball Z Kai, and you can actually enjoy a full episode and get a full episode's worth of content um, to watch. To, I mean, I'll I'll be glad for that if they do. You know, if they will or not. Probably though, they'll once the series ends, it's still got popularity. It'll, but anyways, back to the manga. I tend to get off topic a lot, by the way. If you're watching these videos, this will probably be a pretty long video, probably 45 minutes. Um, that's as long as my memory card actually is, so probably about 45 minutes, somewhere in that range, unless I decide to go dump the date and recording it. So it'll probably be like four videos on YouTube. Um, I'll cut here and there. Uh, I need something to do tonight. But anyway, back to the magic. Uh, my guess with Bleach right now, they're at the uh, Aizen. Aizen's actually put his plan into motion to take over. Um, they're at battle. Ichigo's biding his time. Uh, Naruto, I'm not sure what's going on right now. Last time I checked, um, Sasuke had, was having his brother's eyes put into him so he could get the special Sharingan. Um, I forget what it's called at the moment. And I'm not going to go check, so. <laughs> Maybe in a future video I will correct whatever it is I said wrong, but right now. Sasuke's getting that. Naruto has mastered Sage Mode. They're heading to their final battle. Um, probably the series will wrap up maybe another year. Maybe. Depends on how far they stretch it out. I don't know. As I said, don't read the manga, so I really don't know. I don't really keep up that much on anime either, so... Once in a while, I'll watch a new series. It'll be good. I probably may talk about it. Don't know. Again, it just as the mood strikes me. Um, probably one of the most underestimated series, and um, probably one of the best I've seen so far, Scrapped Princess. If you want a good anime series, Scrapped Princess. It's short. It's like 24 episodes. Um, it's not going to take you like three weeks to watch it. You can watch it in a week. I think that's what I did with it. When I originally watched it was I watched the whole series in a week. It's a really good episode. As far as rewatchability goes, uh, it's got some moments, but I have yet to be able to sit back through the whole series. So, watch it once, enjoy it. Rune Soldier Louie, uh, Rune Soldier, another really good series um, that's based in the Lotus War 
um, world setting. Rune Soldier Louis. Very funny. Very, very funny. If you like the animation from Record of the Lodos War, I would totally tell you to check out Rune Soldier. It is a comedy, though. It's set in the same universe, but it's a comedy. It's not the heavy drama that Lotus War was. So, again, it's, uh, it's a good anime. It's a good anime. Uh, my brother has, my brother did get me the, both Star Wars trilogies for my birthday, which I have yet to watch. I keep planning on watching it. I still haven't even hooked up my VCR since I moved back into my parent or my DVD player since I moved back into my parent. See how old I am? I'm saying VCR. Yeah. <laughs> if I could find a VCR tape in my house, I would be amazed. So, we do have a working VCR, though, downstairs. But, um, it is a DVD player. He got me the whole set. I haven't watched it yet. I haven't even opened it yet. Um, July was a really bad month for me, basically. Um, didn't get a lot accomplished. Basically, it was a really down month. Didn't get a lot accomplished. Basically, sat in my room a lot. Um, started to write. August has been a lot better. Gotten a lot done since, uh, August. So, um, really got, getting back in the swing of things. Like I said, hope to be back at work probably next week. Beginning of the week after that. Somewhere in that range, be back at work. Um, so, that will really help me out. Plus, I'll get some money then. Thinking about becoming a bartender. I know. Bartending. But, um, I think it would be fun. Plus, um, I love to go out there and meet new people. Especially when I'm, I mean, once I get back into the swing of things, get to talking to people, get to joking around a lot. You probably see it on the videos. Um, it's just an opener of people. Hang with me. It'll get better. <laughs> um, but yeah, like I said, think about bartending, go back to work a couple weeks, get some money up, uh, go ahead and go to bartending school, see what I can do with that, um, may go back to college, don't know, uh, you never know, you never know what's going to happen, I've been saying I'm going to go back to college now for like 8 years, by the way, I'm 28 years old, so, many of you people I ask, and 28 years old, Yes, I am living with my parents, and I am 28 years old, and I am putting that on YouTube, so. I know, my life is pathetic shambles. It's horrible. I don't know what to do. But, um, no, I'm, I'm starting to get things back together. The breakup with my girlfriend was really hard. Um, not so much for her. She kind of moved on quick. Uh, day after, in fact, she had moved on. Uh, <laughs> That's a real kick in the noggin right there. It's like you live with someone, you pay, help pay the bills. Day after, you break up. Day after, boom, she's with someone new. So, wow, she moves on quick. Um, what can I say? I was a little more attached. Uh, I didn't move on quite as quickly. But um, I wish her all the best. Um, so, but yeah. <laughs> But yeah, so um, it's August. I'm hoping to get back together. I'm kind of rambling here, but this is just a blog. I'm just in the mood to talk, so I've got the camera on and I'm talking. That's all it is. It's not the normal scripted stuff I do with Francois Dupree. I may do some scripts later on, like reviews. Review. All my reviews will be scripted, um, at least in a broad sense of the word. Um, the um, Zombie Diaries. That was I had wrote that out first. It was one of my first reviews, though, so I think I did it in, like, two or three takes. Um, hopefully my reviews will get better as I go, but um, this is just mindless rambling. This, this just gives you a chance to get to know me, so hi. Hi, everybody. Um, it's Saturday night, and I'm home. <laughs> I'm at home buzzing off my man energy drink. So that's how my Saturday nights go right now. Oh my god. It's the State Farm commercial. Commercial. The State Farm commercial. Where they talk about the vanishing deductible. The guy with the phone around his neck looks like he's freaking insane. Yeah. Definitely Arkham Asylum patient there. They let him out a little too, too early. Could be like the Joker. You know, that's 